Welcome back YouTubers. Um, if it's the first time you're tuning into my channel, please make sure that you click on the subscribe button there. And also there's a bell right on the side. Please click on it as well so that you can be notified if there's new videos coming in future. Now, what are we doing today? Today, I want to show you how the Zoom H6 recorder and the Zoom meeting application as are like so made up for each other. They work beautifully together. The reason why I'm saying that, I've been trying to see how I can send audio from my phone, play music from my iTunes, in fact, into the meeting. For instance, while people are still waiting for the meeting to, to continue or to start, then you can be playing music in the background. But at this time, you're not sharing the screen from the Zoom application but you only sending audio. Maybe there's a better way of doing it, but then this is how I'm doing it using the Zoom H6 recorder. So tune in and let's see how we're going to do it. This is all you need to have. You need to have your H6 Zoom recorder. Your recorder must have a line in over there. What if you can see there, right there. So you got your line in and you got your normal cable. Um, I'm, I have my TRRS cable because of the three lines, but you can have a normal um, audio cable with the two lines. The two lines will be left and right um, headphones. And then obviously your phone there. Now here goes the connection. If you're using a new phone without a jack, you will plug this in, this converter. But I don't need it because this one has a jack, plug it in there, and then you go into your line in. And then make sure you have your, your left and right button on. These lights must come on. If they're off, then there won't be no audio transmitted into your Zoom recorder. So they come in, and then you can control with the knob there. The input volume so sound will go in from the phone into the zoom recorder out with the USB into your your iMac or your computer this is where now your zoom meeting when you select your audio you must select your 86 zoom it will show the 86 zoom as your mic so audio coming in to your computer will be from the 86 not from your uh, built-in mic of your computer. So that's all you need to have. Just play music there. Just make sure the levels are okay. It's not too loud. Um, you can still, you still want them to converse while they're waiting for the meeting to start. Then just control it over there with the knob. And voila, you got your music playing. All right, so that's how it works. Well, it, it's working for me. I hope it's going to work for you. Um, there's no reason why it wouldn't work. It, it should work. But if there's a better way, please let me know. Uh, write your comment there. There probably is a better way of doing it, simpler way of doing it if you don't have a recorder. But if you do have a recorder, you use it. You've got nothing to lose. Your audio is beautiful. You use a mic, you know, external mic. You have crystal clear uh, audio that you're sending into the Zoom meeting. And the music that you're playing also, it's sending there without any echoes. So it will work for you because it's working for me. Well, my name is Neomara Peri and I'm signing out.